Just another grunt, I'm afraid. Prophet could have told us more. At least we have the nano gear intact. That's all that really matters. The rest I'll have to improvise once I'm in the suit. Ah, my young friend. I had hoped to spare you consciousness here, but the nano gear is not proving cooperative. Let's get started. Sorry for this betrayal, but I really have no choice. I need the suit. This particular suit, in fact, if I'm to have any hope at all of stopping the set. A simple soldier will not suffice you. I don't understand what's going on. You're in, Prophet. Your suits alert the Seth's nano systems. You've got to go back. You're our best hope. You twisted motherfucker. You knew. You knew the suits were symbiotic. You knew what they'd do to my men. Turn them into dead men walking! I turned them into post-human warriors. You're a soldier. Think of it as necessary sacrifice. You lied to us! Perhaps I was economical with the truth, yes. But what choice did I have? What choice do you have now? The Seph are coming, Prophet. Soon. You think we'll defeat them with ordinary human soldiers? This isn't a war ordinary humans can win. This is the future. Death's an inconvenience now. Nothing more. We are all dead men walking. The suit's rejecting the rip! It's overloading! Stop him. Kill him if you have to, but don't damage the nano gear. Headshots only. Nice try, Tin Man. Now say goodnight. Tara, no! Tara, listen to me! It's okay, you're safe. I'm CIA, Special Operations Group. Recruited out of the SEALs three years ago. I'm the one who ordered your squad to bring Prof and Gould out. Yeah, screwed now, of course. Look, there'll be time to explain later. Right now, the Ceph are breaking into this place, and we gotta get Hargreave out. The man is insane. He thinks he's the only competent human being on the planet. But he's got vital knowledge on the Ceph. He stole their technology a hundred years ago at Tunguska. He's been working on it ever since. Three years ago, he was the puppet master behind the mess at Ling Shan that killed my father. He's got some kind of plan for confronting the invasion, and we need to know what it is. He's holed up in the executive level, through that way. Heavy security. No one gets in to see him face to face. Believe me, I've tried. You're gonna have to break him. I'll get up to the helipad and secure our transport. Bring him out and meet me there. We fly him out, we take him someplace we can make him talk. I'll stay on comms and keep you posted. Now go! Tactical options available.
coffee. than you would at least expect to see the Minotaur before it kills you. Ah well, it seems only fair. Come then. Masks off. I am here. Shocked? I would be. I'd revel in it if I were you. That sudden jump of the pulse, the cram of the fight or flight chemicals into the belly. So sweet while it lasts. But it's been very long since I felt any of it. A century or more since my pleasures were anything but cerebral. I took the path Carl Rash refused, the cold road to immortality. I'd hoped to wear Prophet's suit myself, take on the weapons he brought us, wear his armor, enter the labyrinth and confront the Minotaur. But now... You... You will have to finish what Prophet began. Get out of there, Alcatraz! No! Wait! There is a final piece of the puzzle you need. There on the desk. Take the syringe. Take the syringe. Take it. Based in this cesspit city because I like it here? You were waiting for them. Why didn't you warn someone? Warn whom? Humanity at large? Look what you've done, old man! They're here! You That's right, Nathan. The owners are back. Waking the systems, firing up the boiler, back to spring clean the old family residence. And not much liking what they found festering behind the fridge. Can you blame them, really? Ah, the angels of death at last. My escort back to human friends. Well, took you long enough. Out of there, Alcatraz. <laughs> yes, that's it. Go, go, save us all. <laughs> this is Jacob Hargreave to all cell personnel. Commander Lockhart is dead. I will be 
joining him shortly, and the PRISM facility is wired to explosively self-destruct. Subject Prophet is now your only hope of turning back the alien invasion. You will therefore discontinue hostilities and afford him every assistance you can as you evacuate this island. All, pr all prison facilities will explosively self-seal in 10 minutes. Your employee duties are terminated. Please exit via the indicated channels. Alcatraz, the roof is trashed. There's nothing flyable up here. I'm heading for the Queensport Bridge. Meet me on the far side if you can. Get down! to me, Alcatraz. Hargreave never bluffed in his life. This place is going up. You've got, got to get out of there. Moving, Alcatraz. We're heading across town to the bridge. Hurry!
lose everything. an afterlife, I wonder? Choirs of angels? Or a fiery pit? One unlearns these falsehoods over time, but the child who learned to fear hell is never really gone. To tell the truth, I think I've had quite enough of afterlives as it is. This one has been pretty purgatorial. Almost 50 years floating in super cool jelly like some medical specimen. Thoughts creeping like rats through the cramped silicon corridors of machines, trapped behind video screens and camera systems. Never sleeping, never resting, never ceasing to think about the world you no longer belong to. No, if this is a taste of the afterlife, I think simple oblivion will do nicely. Please exit via the indicated channels. Don't waste your time, Alcatraz. Get across the bridge. 